everyone and welcome back to a writing guy it's been a while since my last video with the pelican m1000 and today i would like to present to you all a different model one that is more faithful to the original design and proportions plus is also to commemorate a significant german figure the pelican m405 stressman in this video i would like to skip over the history of pelican since i have covered it in previous pelican reviews but i would like to mention a bit about the figure himself gustav stressmann he was a german statesman who served as chancellor as well as foreign minister of the weimar republic in the 1920s he was also honored with the nobel peace prize in 1926 now how does all this relate to the design of the m405 pelican and Gustav Stressmann himself. It turns out there was a style of suit named after him, consisting a black and white striped trousers and a black jacket. This led to the design of the pen barrel, replacing the green stripes with the more subtle gray and black stripes. Each of these stripes hits the light differently, giving each pen a unique look, despite the similarity from being made with the same material. This M405 is also in a more humble size compared to the more popular modern models, staying true to the original proportions from the 1950s. Aside from the usual cab design and the gray stripes, what makes this particular example sing is definitely the nib. This M405 sporting a broad nib, giving its line a very distinctive pelican stubbiness to it. Effortless and juicy, it shows a lot of the characters of the shading of the ink on the page as well as the writer's expressions. Aside from the smaller package and not having the hefty feel of a bigger Pelican model, this M405 is definitely a good writing instrument. And before I end this video, I would like to say thanks to a wonderful friend who had lent me this pen for the review. And since he is also parting with it, if you guys are interested, please shoot me an email at a writingguy at gmail.com. Details in the description. Thank you guys for watching and I'll see you in the next one.